hey guys welcome to my channel so today's video is just gonna be a vlog it's not gonna be a daily vlog it's probably just gonna be a nightly vlog um first of all check out this hold on let me get a better angle for you guys first off check out this sunset i am feeling so good like i feel amazing 2021 was a great year for me i reflected a lot i accomplished a lot there are a lot of things that i um wanted to improve on and if you guys watched my strategic planning video for 2020 for the one that i kind of just posted i don't know when this video is going to go up so but i made my 2021 improvement list improvement wall whatever you want to call it even laminated it i laminated it y'all it got laminated um because there are a lot of things that, that i want to improve on they're not really major things they're kind of just things that i've noticed that have kind of prevent me from progressing in the way that i want to progress so i kind of made my list what i have left to do today is i need to type out my 2021 um reflection because I have reflected, but I haven't typed it out yet. And I have my reflection wall, but I want to have a physical document on it. Well, not in mood, but I've just been in the energy of kind of just documenting everything because I want to keep, I want to be able to go back and check things off and say, you know what? Yeah, I did this. I did that. But um, I did do an H&M clothing haul. Um, so I'm probably going to incorporate that into this vlog, obviously, but for the most part, I, I just have a couple of like papery things to do. I've already written out what I wanted to do for the month of January. Kind of just have to clean and do some laundry and figure out what I'm going to eat for dinner. All right, guys, so now I am just sorting my laundry because I definitely need to do that today. I don't have a huge load. I probably just have like two different loads and then wash my bed sheets and then that's it. So closet for the most part is already organized. I also cleaned up my living room area. My breakfast table is nice and clean. The one area that is just a mess and it's always a mess, it doesn't matter how much I clean it, is my desk. And the one thing that I don't like about this apartment is that the desk is so small and I have so much stuff. So this is kind of just what my workstation looks like. Yeah, it's a mess. I am trying to figure out the best way to organize this area, but it's just so small and I don't want to add shelving because I'm not trying to mess with these people's walls and put holes in it and things of that sort. So I'm just going to leave it, organize what I can organize, and then I kind of just let it be. But, but the one thing I love is my chair. Like, look at that. It's so cute. It's like a swivel chair. So I kind of just sit like this and then I'm like... But yeah, um, for the most part, everything's clean. I have, I'm gonna go make some dinner now. I'm just gonna have leftovers because I'm not able to cook, but I am gonna make some um, garlic, onion, rice to go with the chicken that my mom brought for me and some other just leftover stuff I have in my fridge because I cleaned today. I still have stuff to do, it's about 6.30, but I made up a lot of time. Like I got a lot of stuff done in my time frame, so I'm gonna cook dinner. Then I'm gonna like clean up the kitchen, put away my dishes and stuff. Probably going to switch out my loads of laundry, 
then I'm going to shower, get ready for bed, and then once I'm getting ready for bed, that's when I'll type up my 2021 reflection, my 2022 goals, and then probably start editing either this vlog or my 10, um, 10 high income and demand skills to learn in 2022. So that's Alright, so starting off with the H&M haul, I have this beautiful cream turtleneck tunic. I love this tunic. It is so soft. I like the small details of the slit on the side. I also like how the sleeves go slightly over my shoulders because I do have broad shoulders. So being able to hide that is always a plus for me. This tunic is so soft. I love how it's knit. This is a perfect type of clothing to wear un underneath you know jackets and trench coats and things of that sort and I love how it's long enough so I can wear it over jeans over pants over leggings it's just a great type of clothing to have during the winter season so next we have this rib knit crop top in the color light yellow this crop top is so cute i'm a big fan of anything that's knit really i just love how comfortable it makes me feel i kind of sort of think this is more of like a pralette in my opinion but i needed more tops that i can wear around the house or tops that i could wear underneath like my blazers or with sweatpants so that's why i decided to go with something cozy like this Next, we have this beautiful black crop sweater vest. I know sweater vests <laughs> are kind of like old fashioned, but I love sweater vests. I just think that it can just take your most simplest outfit and just make it into something. I really like how this is more crop and it's more of a fitted um, crop. It's more of a fitted vest because a lot of my vests are more oversized. And I'm thinking about finding some sort of like pin or a brooch to put on this vest because I think it would look super super cute and I just like the black and white knit contrasting on the sleeves I think it adds a lot of character to the vest as well this next item is one of the least of my favorites from my haul it's just an oversized black and green no fear vest sweater vest not really a big fan of it it's loose and it's oversized as well like the material is not really the best the quality isn't the best but i guess i like the green and black feature because i just needed some more color within my closets but other than like the black and white kind of contrasting or um, graphic design that's the only reason why i like it because the quality is just crap we are going to take a sunset break. I want you guys to just look at this sunset and just look at how beautiful it looks. Like even me watching this right now, I'm just like, oh my God, it's so pretty. I don't know about you guys, but looking at the sky just brings me so much tranquility and it makes me feel at peace and it makes me feel gratitude and it just makes me feel amazing. So that's why I always love looking at the sunsets or the sunrise and kind of just, you know, enjoying the moment next we have this chocolate fine knit turtleneck sweater and i love it i don't really have a lot of um chocolate turtlenecks i know chocolate was a color that i really wanted to focus on during my fall winter you know clothing season 
um but yeah this is just a regular turtleneck sweater it's tight in the right areas and it's loose where it needs to be loose but this is just a perfect item to just layer with so that's why having a turtleneck is just an essential item in your closet so this is like my favorite piece of everything that i bought it's just this chocolate or this brown this dark brown patterned short puffer jacket and i just love it i am a big trench coach person but you can't wear a trench coat with every outfit. Sometimes you just need a puffer jacket. I do have a black one, but I knew that I needed another color. And because this has pattern, it definitely will add more character to my outfit to kind of just add a little bit of, you know, chapaz when it's needed. <laughs> the last item in this haul is just this black and white contrast leather tote bag. I'm a big tote bag person. I love tote bags. I just think there's a lot of room and I carry a lot of stuff with me all the time. So I need a bag that can hold all, all of my stuff. But I just thought this was super cute. It has a metal clasp at the top where you're able to kind of just close the bag and how, and I kind of just like how it doesn't have a zipper sometimes because some things just can't zip. <laughs> some of the things I put in my bags just don't zip. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking about buying maybe like a patterned scarf, maybe like a checkered print scarf and tying it on one of the handles just to add a little bit more, you know, character, more boom to the bag. But yeah. All right, guys, that's it for the H&M haul. Right back. Let's get right back into the vlog. Well, that is it for the vlog for today. I'm just gonna finish up the things that I have left to do off camera. Um, thanks for tuning in today. Thanks for watching my vlog. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Remember, I'm gonna be posting every single Sunday. And if you wanna keep up with me on social media, my Instagram is underscore F3YISAYL. And I will see you guys in my next video. I got the skincare routine. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Definitely gonna have to cut that out.